In this tutorial, I'm going to show you two different ways to hide zeros in an Excel spreadsheet. Um, the first way, well, first of all, I have just kind of a fictional um, setup here where I have uh, two values that I'm going to enter each month. Well, since it's February still, I don't have the values for February or the rest of the year. So what's going to happen here is um, I've got this formula. C2 plus C3, D2, D3, and so on. And uh, so zeros are just going to appear because I don't have values in here. Uh, if I did, uh, it would add up. But since I don't, it doesn't. And so I'm going to show you two ways on how to hide the zeros. The first way is a uh, format formatting thing. So I'm going to go up to File, and this is an Excel 2010. It should be kind of similar for uh, newer versions as well. Older versions are going to be a little bit different, so uh, this is for 2010. So I'm going to go to File, Options, and then up to Advanced. So File, Options, Advanced. I'm just going to scroll down and at uh, display options for this worksheet and you can select uh, if there's a different worksheet that you want to use but it's just for this one and then I'm just going to uncheck this box here that says show a zero in cells that have zero value so un uncheck that click OK and as you can see my formulas are still there there's just no zero showing so I'm going to undo that real quick before I show you the second part the second part I don't necessarily agree with it but it gets the job done and um, you know it's just showing you a second way so now I'm going to use conditional formatting and since I know the zeros are only going to be here I can just highlight them, or if I want to just highlight the whole sheet, I can go up here in the corner and click it. And so I'm going to go up to, on the Home tab, Conditional Formatting, go down to Highlight Cells Rules, and I'm going to do Equal To. Uh, format cells that are equal to zero. Oops, it's an O. Zero. So it shows it highlights all of them. It says uh, light, fill, light red fill with dark red text. But I don't want that because that's going to just, you know, make the problem even worse. So I'm going to go to custom format. And then on the font tab here, that's just what it opens to by default. I'm going to go down to uh, the color and it just goes to automatic. But I'm going to change that to white. And I'm going to click OK. And OK again. So uh, right now the the spreadsheet is highlighted so you can see that it has changed zero values to white and when I click anywhere they appear to go away so they're not going to show when I print uh, and it's just you're just going to not have that nuisance of all the zero values anymore so I hope this tutorial helped and I look forward to helping you in the future I'd appreciate it if you subscribe. I'm going to have lots more tutorials, tons of things to help you with. I'm always thinking of new ideas for videos. So have a great day, and hopefully I'll see you again in the future.